it's time for the game of the week the atlanta falcons led by marcus mariota playing at home against the san francisco 49ers jimmy garoppolo and the 49ers fantastic defense niners are here to pluck the bird let's go they've got a two game winning streak going on and atlanta's looking to bounce back from the tough loss to division rival tampa bay buccaneers this is going to be an absolutely fantastic matchup between a great run game for the atlanta falcons and a tremendous defensive uh play from the 49ers it's the falcons it's the niners it's time for the madden sim robbie gold to kick off good news that robbie gold is healthy and ready to go this week and the kick is on its way and the return is out almost to the 20 not a bad return for the falcons they're going to start at the 20 marcus mariota lined up in the shotgun heavy set to the top mariota with the give and algier is going to get a nice gain on first down picking up six and Atlanta's on the move early to start this drive. Niners got it stiffen on the run, D. Mariota looks to throw and incomplete. Looking for a receiver over the middle, but the ball falls incomplete. That's going to bring up third and four. Mariota looks. He finds a receiver over the middle. Uh, they He did not get the first. I thought maybe they would give him the spot, but Womack brings down London in front of the sticks, and that's going to force a punt from the Atlanta Falcons. Nice tackle. And here's the punt. Richie James. Oh, Richie James. Ray Ray McLeod waiting for it. Wow, I just flashed back to 2019 on that one. <laughs> hey, no problem. I remember that year. Uh, Ray Ray McLeod with a decent return on the play. Jimmy Garoppolo gets it going in the shotgun. And Brandon Ayuk with the reception, and he's going to pick up nine. A early completion for Jimmy Garoppolo against this Atlanta Falcons defense. Nice read by Jimmy. Jimmy Garoppolo with the give up the middle, and it looks like Jeff Wilson Jr. is able to get the first down, and the 49ers move the sticks. Debo's in the backfield, and he's getting running. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Jeff Wilson Jr. Second and six for the 49ers, a four-yard gain on first down. Debo is in the backfield this time. He's going out for a pass. Jimmy Garoppolo throws it to the sideline, and George Kittle makes a catch. Bringing up third and four. Jimmy in the shotgun. Throws it over the middle. And it's complete for a first down. Brandon Ayuk moves the sticks with a big play over the middle. And Jimmy Garoppolo has come out so far on fire. The run to Debo Samuel goes nowhere. It stopped at the line of scrimmage. And it's going to force a second and 10. 49ers now with trips bunch to the top of the field. Jimmy Garoppolo's got a clean pocket. And along the sideline, he finds his open receiver and completes the pass to Debo Samuel. And the 49ers continue to drive, moving the sticks with a great completion. And now Tevin Coleman gets the run up the middle. And what a run it is, an explosive play. Tevin now with two rushes for 18 yards. Coleman making big plays for this offense. The offense is starting to gel. Offense is rolling. Jimmy Garoppolo again with a give to Tevin Coleman. He breaks the tackle. He spins off. Uh, he throws a guy away. What, what has gotten into Tevin Coleman? Coleman picks up nine yards on first down. Coleman looked good in that run. Three carries for 27 yards for Tevin Coleman. And Jimmy Garoppolo is in the shotgun. And he throws the pass and is complete. Brandon Ayuk with the touchdown. Touchdown 49ers. And they take the first drive down the field and score. This is something the 49ers have been doing all season. Nice patience by Jimmy. Good read. Ayuk worked himself into a hole in that defense. I felt like there was receivers open all over the place. There Kittle was. was open. Ray Ray McLeod was open. Yeah, it's not Richie James. Ray Ray McLeod was open. Uh, but the kick is up and good for the extra point. Robbie Gold makes it 7-0. to zero, And now the 49ers kick off. And Atlanta is going to return again. Hopefully getting a good return for them so that way they can start their second drive. Uh, tackle down just short of the 24-yard line. That's where Atlanta is going to start. Mariota with the give to the outside, and it's going nowhere. The 49ers set the edge. Traverius Ward comes up and makes the tackle for no gain. Mariota in the shotgun. 
Oh, what a hit. <laughs> it's a completion, but Talano Hufanga, what's up with a huge hit on the receiver? Dino might. <laughs> oh, Mariota using his legs. He slides, but he picks up the first down in front of Fred Warner. Marcus Mariota's elite ability to run the football on display on that play. Mariota in an empty formation. He's got a clean pocket. And he throws to the sideline, but it's out of bounds, incomplete. Way too much time there. Second and 10 for Atlanta. So far, the 49ers have not been able to get pressure on Mariota. And Mariota uh, gets it out. And it's Drake London, uh, the young rookie. He picks up two yards, a little quick pass. And that's going to bring the end of the first quarter with the San Francisco 49ers leading the Atlanta Falcons 7-0. to Atlanta looking to convert on a third and eight. They, com they convert about 40%. During the season, let's see what Mario does. And he's looking to run, and he runs into his own offensive lineman. Oh, my God. And Samson Ebucom gets the sack. Samson got that on the rebound. Yeah, he did. Look at this. Boom! Right into his <laughs> right tackle. And Ebucom gets the sack. Hey, you'll take it. Uh, Ebucom with a big-time sack, and that's going to force a punt from the Atlanta Falcons. So two drives and two stops for the 49ers defense. Ray Ray McLeod with the return. He's going to get a nice return. Picks up about 14 yards. That's a solid return for McLeod. And now the 49ers offense looks to build upon what they did in their first drive that led to a touchdown. Jimmy Garoppolo hands the ball off to Jeff Wilson Jr. And he gets a nice gain up the middle. But there's a flag on the play. And it is going to be holding against the 49ers, which means the 49ers are going to start in a hole. Uh, Second-year player Aaron Banks is the one that they catch getting the hold on. That's First and 17. One way to make a block. <laughs> yeah, except for when they catch you. And, it's all right. Uh, Jeff Wilson Jr. with the run here. The 49ers going back to the run game. He picks up three. That's going to bring up second and 14. Still double sticks for the 49ers. They need to get some yardage on this play. Jeff Wilson Jr. with a carry up the middle. He's going to power forward and pick up six yards, but it brings up third and long, third and eight for the 49ers. Jimmy's in the shotgun. He has a clean pocket, and he completes the pass over the middle to Tevin Coleman, but he's tackled down right there, and that's going to end the drive for the 49ers, and the 49ers are going to be forced to punt. Here comes Mish Wisnowski. Wisnowski with the punt. And it is a nice punt. It's bouncing, and it's downed inside the five-yard line down at the three. That's where Atlanta's going to start. Wow. Oh, but right away, Algier up the middle, and he picks up the first down on first and 10 and gives Atlanta some breathing room. Mariota now in the empty formation in a shotgun. Spreading the 49ers defense out. Mariota gets the ball out quickly over the middle, and he completes the pass. And Atlanta's got something going on here with two straight plays of over 10 yards. Mariota gives this time to Caleb Huntley, but he is stuffed at the line of scrimmage. And it's a great play by Charles Aminahieu. He sets the edge and it creates a two-yard loss. And now Atlanta's facing second and 12. Mariota gets the ball down the field. And he finds his open receiver. What a nice catch. Nice throw, nice uh, catch. Yeah, Zacchaeus with a big-time play. And he beat Charvarius Ward. Haven't heard of that very many times this time this year. Uh, just before the two-minute warning, Mariota gets it to the sideline. And it looks like he's got a completion along the sideline, and he does. That was the two-minute warning. And now second and six for the Atlanta Falcons. Mariota with a nice, clean pocket. 49 yards unable to get pressure, and he completes the pass. Mariota's looking pretty solid on this drive, Classic. He is looking very good. They're just not getting pressure up front with the Niners. There he goes on a run. No pressure again. There is a flag on the play, but if this stands, it's a nine-yard gain. It is holding against Atlanta, so Atlanta gets caught uh, holding, and that means the 49ers are going to, you know, have an opportunity to get a stop here. It's now first and 20 for Atlanta. Well, that's why he had a clean pocket. <laughs> Marcus Mariota in the shotgun. He looks down the field. And it's another big-time catch. Wow. On Charverius Ward. And Zacchaeus again 
Wow, what a throw and catch. And Atlanta's in business. They are now inside the red zone at the 15-yard line, looking to score before the end of the first half. Mariota is getting some pressure, but he finds a screen pass. And Algier, oh, he's dragging, carrying Samson Ebucom all the way inside the five-yard line. Atlanta uses a timeout, but they are in business at first and goal, looking to punch it in here with under a minute left in the first half. He gets the ball to Algier, but this time Dre Greenlaw says, no soup for you. And he makes the tackle in the backfield, and that's a huge stop. Nice 40... open field tackle there. Can the 49ers keep Atlanta out of the end zone uh, at the end of the half here? Mariota's got another clean pocket. Wow. And he throws an absolute dart to the back of the end zone and is caught by Kyle Pitts over Ombre Thomas. Touchdown Atlanta Falcons. And they're about to tie this game up. What a throw and catch. And the bigger Kyle Pitts just took advantage of the size of Ombre Thomas. That was a nice throw and catch. It really was. Good read by Mariota. So Chu on to kick the extra point. And it is good. And Atlanta ties the game 7-7 with 47 seconds left in the first half. What will Kyle Shanahan do? Will he try to get some points? Or will he just go ahead and go into the second half looking to get the football back? Jimmy Garoppolo starts in the shotgun. Let's see what Kyle Shanahan elected to do. If the 49ers can find a matchup they like, it's a play action. A nice blitz pickup. Oh, and it's Brandon IU catching the ball downfield on a deep corner route. And he outruns everyone to the end zone. 11 seconds into their drive, and Brandon Ayuk scores a touchdown, and the 49ers answer in a big way here at the end of the first half. That was a very nice pickup by the running back, uh, Tevin Coleman. Yeah, Tevin Coleman with a huge blitz pickup, and Brandon Ayuk wide open. Jimmy Garoppolo finds the open receiver, and just like that, the 49ers are kicking off up 14-7. What a momentum swing that was. That was huge. Atlanta looking to get a good return, but so far have not been able to get much going. Get out just past the 20. That's where Mario is going to take over with 31 seconds left in this first half. He throws it downfield, and there's a flag on the play. Pass intended for Drake London, and it's going to be pass interference against the 49ers. That'll move you downfield real quick as Diamond Lenore gets caught getting too handsy with London. And that means first and 10 for Atlanta. You want to see the, the Niners play physical, but no penalties. Don't like 20-yard penalties, I'll tell no. you that much. And Mariota's looking to run again. There's another flag down on the play. But the ball is the ball is loose. Hufanga blows up Mariota. All-pro Fred picks it up, and he's got a convoy to the end zone. It's a touchdown, 49ers. What is the flag for? That's going to be the big question. If it's on Atlanta, it's a touchdown 49ers. It's a holding call against Atlanta. The play will stand. Talanoa Hufanga with an absolutely huge hit. And Fred Warner picks it up and takes it to the house. And the 49ers have scored 14 points in the last 30 seconds. Wow. Kyle Shanahan's feeling it. He's loving it. Look at him right now. He's enjoying what just happened. Telling all pro Fred, great play. What a play that was, and Hufanga started it all with the big hit. I think Shanny was ready to do the end zone dance. I think he was, too. 49ers take the lead 21-7 to with 15 seconds left in the half. What could go wrong has went wrong for the Atlanta Falcons, and I bet you they're looking to get into the locker room without having any more things happen over the next 11 seconds. So they line up with a strong set. Marcus Mariota hands off the football, and Algier's going to get going, but he's going to get stopped by Dre Greenlaw for a minimal gain, and that's going to be the end of the first half. The 49ers lead the game 21-7 because of some big plays down the field, the huge throw to Brandon Ayuk, and then the fumble caused by Talanu Ufonga, picked up by Fred Warner all the way to the house. Those are the plays that change games. This defense is very opportun opportunistic. Opportunistic, yeah. Yes. I'm with you on that one. Ray Ray McLeod gets out almost to the 30, so a solid return for the return specialist. And Jimmy Garoppolo's in the shotgun, and he's going to give the ball up the middle to Jeff Wilson Jr. And Wilson wow. absolutely powers himself forward. 
picks up more than enough for the first down, and the 49ers get the second half off to a huge start with a nice, explosive run. Those feet just kept turning, man. He didn't stop. And now it's a play action. Jimmy rolls left. He gets it out to his open receiver, and it's George Kittle. And, and George Kittle gets some nice yardage, and Jimmy Garoppolo is now 8 of 8 for 134 yards and two touchdowns. What a game so far for Jimmy. The people's tight end. And Jimmy goes right back to George Kittle. And George Kittle picks up seven yards, bringing up second and three. And the 49ers are in business again as they're driving towards Atlanta's end zone. And there's a give up the middle, and it's another first down 49ers. Debo Samuel this time, the wide back, picking up the necessary yardage. Jimmy Garoppolo is back to pass. And Tevin Coleman. Tevin Coleman is the receiver of choice on this one. Jimmy Garoppolo, 10 of 10 for 151 yards now. Nice pass is, protection. Yeah, too. he's on fire. Garoppolo once again finds another. This time, Ray Ray McLeod making a play. And this 49ers offense is absolutely clicking. It's on a roll. Jimmy Garoppolo with oh, a read option. Now you're just doing too much, Jimmy. You're uh, not Trey Lance. Uh, no, you're not a runner. Uh, just, just give the ball, Jimmy. Just give the ball. Uh, but second and goal here, and he's going to pitch it outside to Jeff Wilson Jr. And nothing doing. The Atlanta Falcons stuff it for a loss. What a play by Atlanta. And that's going to force third and goal and outside the 10 now at the 11-yard line. Jimmy gets a clean pocket. And he gets it to Jennings, and Jennings dives forward, and it's touchdown 49ers. Mr. Third down himself, Jawan Jennings, with a big-time play, and he's got himself a touchdown. What a catch. What a extension to get the touchdown. Yeah, he got that ball across the goal line. That was a great extension. Yeah, very nice. Uh, gets himself open, is able to power up over you know, Carter and some of these defenders, and gets into the end zone. Jawan Jennings, absolute beast on the play. And the 49ers are taking a commanding lead 28-7 over the Atlanta Falcons. Here comes the return for Atlanta. Hasn't been a lot of space. Uh, gets out past the 25 on this one, though. So a decent return for Atlanta. And they're going to start near the 27-yard line. Marcus Mariota under center. And they're going to go back to the run game. And Algier gets a nice positive three yards. But... It's going to be, you need a lot more than that if you're going to catch up to the 49ers who are up three scores. Mariota's in the shotgun. Got some time. A mini who almost puts on pressure and he gets the ball down the field and it's Kyle Pitts. Pitts beats the coverage and he's into the end zone for a touchdown. Atlanta is not done yet. They cut it to within two scores. Kyle Pitts, the hybrid tied in with some space. How do you let that guy get open? What a throw by Marcus Mariota. Definitely a blown coverage there. Yeah, he throw it, it you know, behind the corner in front of the safety. Uh, what a find for Mariota. And now they look to get the extra point, and it is good. 28-14 to 14, San Francisco over the Atlanta Falcons. Ray Ray McLeod with the return. And he's going to be brought down at the 25-yard line. That's where Jimmy Garoppolo in this offense is going to take over. They need to use clock while moving the ball strategically down the field. But they should walk away with points on this drive. Don't put it on your defense. And Jeff Wilson Jr. gets it started again. What an explosive run that was. That was a powerful run. A good read to find the openings in the defense. Six carries for 34 yards now for Wilson. Him and Tevin Coleman have been a one-two punch in this game. And now it's going to be Debo. No, Jimmy Garoppolo keeps again, <laughs> and it gets blown up. So far, it's been tough sledding for the Debo package yes. in this game. Atlanta is definitely keying on it. Second and 12 for the 49ers. Jimmy Garoppolo's got a lot of time, and he throws, and it's complete. And it's, you know, oh, Debo Samuel. Debo Samuel with the reception, and that's going to bring up the end of the third quarter. With the 49ers leading the Atlanta Falcons 28 to 14, and the 49ers with the football looking to extend the lead near midfield. Jimmy Garoppolo under center, and he's going to hand the ball off to Jeff Wilson Jr. Wilson absolutely runs over somebody in the middle of the field and picks up five. Jeff Wilson runs angry. 
Yes, he does. 49ers run play action. Jimmy Garoppolo is going to find the open receiver, and it's Jeff Wilson Jr. They run the play, play fake to him. He finds a spot over the middle of the field, and he gets it to him. Way to sit down there in that open zone. Trips Bunch up top. And you know what? This drive has been all Jeff Wilson Jr. right now. Uh, only a pickup of two. So the 49ers look to spread it out on second and eight. And right now it's pitch and catch because Jimmy Garoppolo got it to wide open. George Kittle, he picks up seven yards and it's third and one for the 49ers out past the 30. Nice pitch and catch. Jawan Jennings, Mr. Third down himself, <laughs> makes the catch and the 49ers move the sticks. Jimmy's on fire. Jimmy is on fire right now. And he's got, he just keeps getting clean pockets. What a, what a rifle that was. Jimmy Garoppolo gets it over the middle to Ray Ray McLeod. He's now 17 of 17 for 230 yards. Someone call the fire department. <laughs> First and goal for the 49ers. And Jimmy's going to keep it. Oh, no. <laughs> Jimmy is not going to score uh, three rushes for negative four yards. So if there's something Jimmy's not doing in this game, it's running effectively. Jimmy, be Jimmy, not Trey. Jimmy Garoppolo with play action. And, oh, it's Charlie Warner. Charlie Warner makes a catch over the middle in the end zone for a touchdown. And the San Francisco 49ers are about to extend this lead to 21 again. The 49ers have been firing on all cylinders on offense. Jimmy Garoppolo is having himself a crazy good game. And Warner, the backup tight end, with a huge touchdown catch. Yeah, Warner, the blocking tight end, making a nice grab in the end zone. Robbie Gold comes on to tack on the extra point. The kick is up, and it is good. The 49ers are up 35-14 with just over two minutes left in this football game. Atlanta with the return. They could use a big return here, but it's not going to happen. And we are headed to the two-minute warning. 49ers 35-14. Atlanta looking to make something happen on, here on this drive. Mariota in the shotgun. He's going to run to the right, and he's taken off. And he's trying to make something happen, and he's hit, and the ball is loose. The ball is loose again, and you know what? It's only fitting that Talano Hufanga is the guy that finds the ball. I believe Diometer Lenore is the one that causes the fumble, and Talano Ufonga ends up picking it up. So two fifth rounders for the 49ers coming up big, and now the 49ers have the football up three scores with under two minutes left. I tell you, Ufonga's got a nose for the football. He does. Ufonga caused a fumble earlier, now recovers a fumble, and right now uh, nothing doing for Jeff Wilson Jr. He's stuffed for a three-yard loss. I think Atlanta might have known the 49ers were going to try to run the football. You think? Run the clock out. <laughs> yeah, Atlanta elected not to use a timeout, so uh, the 49ers are kind of just going to be able to run this thing out, it appears. Jeff Wilson Jr. gets forward for three yards. But wait, uh, Jimmy Garoppolo's in the shotgun. Oh, wow. <laughs> Let's see what the 49ers elect to do. Uh, he's going he's gonna to keep, and he's going to run around the outside. He's going to be tackled by Evans there. Uh, four carries for negative one yards, and they line up for a field goal. Come on, Madden. What are you doing? They're not going to kick no field goal. And time expires. Uh, the San Francisco 49ers beat Arthur Smith and the Atlanta Falcons. 35-14. to 14. Jimmy Garoppolo with an absolute hot streak. He was so good in this game, going for four touchdowns. Jimmy was definitely on his game this for this game here today against Atlanta. And I'm just wondering if we're going to see the same scenario that we seen last week where the coach gets fired. I don't think Arthur Smith will get fired, but the 49ers ha did, in fact, help Matt Rule get a vacation where he's going to get paid very heavily. And you're watching the highlights of what was a fantastic game between the San Francisco 49ers and the Atlanta Falcons. The 49ers defeat the Atlanta Falcons 35-14. Jimmy Garoppolo with over 230 yards and four touchdowns. What a great game. Can't wait for next week for another Madden Sim. Hope you guys all join us again next week. Looks great. That was a fun game to watch.